let's start with GameStop. So GameStop had a nice little midday run, mostly tracking with the upward move on the market. Um, and then, you know, weekly's weekly's kind of dumping out into the end of the day, but still closing up a little bit, 3% on the day. Um, this is good going into next week, but not particularly good. Uh, most, most of the $40 contracts were closed earlier in the week, and the ones that were left were largely weeklies. Um, so those will probably be sold off into close. I highly doubt we're going to see a huge amount of those exercised. Um, BBBY, uh, straight up like all day. Um, it slipped its trend a little bit here into close, um, but it recovered really nicely um, and closed at 12.95, so up 21.83%. Um, this has driven significantly more options into the money over the course of the day. Um, almost like 2,000 OI, 200,000 OI. This will be very significant unless they can get the price back below $10 by like close of market Monday. If they don't, Tuesday, whatever imbalance is created here will have to be hedged. And because so many of the BBBY calls are at like five and six and seven dollars, we could actually see a pretty decent amount of exercising go on. Um, so, you know, this, this is how you set up a gamma squeeze, right? Is, you know, these large amounts of OI going in the money, staying in the money, and then driving further price action that allows very deep in the money calls to be exercised very cheaply. Revlon dropping to 650 is still not in the range where I want to average down and it really recovered into the end of the day back up to 656 and 666 and after hours. Uh, I'm still hoping that Monday and Tuesday we will see a lower low on this. Um, we may not, uh, in which case, you know, I'll have to chase a little bit, but uh, I'm, I'm really still aiming for like that $5 range. I could pick up some here in DCA, but I'd, I'd rather just either hit it or I don't. Um, and lastly, the SPY, for no apparent reason and on constantly decreasing volume, uh, managed to climb one po 167 basis points today um, into a range where there's relatively very few bullish uh, positions. Um, you know, 430 has a few, which we discussed yesterday. Uh, but this area between like four, uh, 4250 and four, um, 4300, sorry, uh, 4300 is pretty weak. Um, and I haven't seen any built up today, but we'll see if, you know, more of this builds up going into Monday. Next week we have SLD, which begins on Wednesday and usually is met with some downside action in the market. Um, hopefully, uh, that will trigger some capitulation in this market that has been running so strongly for so many days now. That's about it. Um, members only stream Sunday at 12 30 PM. Uh, thank you guys so much for tuning in and I'll see you next week. Have a good one. And uh, congratulations to everybody on BBBY today. It was a bitch to hold it, but now it's finally worth something. Half of what it was when most of us bought it, but still up. Thanks, guys. Have a good one.